expert mode here we go in three two one let's go uh, should probably start the timer it doesn't matter it's not official anyway <laughs> didn't even invite us oh your invite must must have uh gotten lost in the mail gordon my apologies <laughs> No, I just don't want anything happening while uh, if the internet goes awry again, but I doubt it. So about it. Well, I now have more information on that. Uh, of course, the first thing I talk about is uh, PO6. So before I get to that, I'm gonna talk about uh, I'm gonna talk about Shadow the Hedgehog a little bit. So if you don't know, this game is from 2005. Um, it was released apparently intended for American audiences and because it's for American audiences in the early 2000s That means we've got a lot of edge and by A lot of edge. I mean shadow curses actually just about everybody curses in this game We've got alien invaders. We got cities being blown up. We got good or evil Oh my goodness so much stuff going on and people notoriously don't like this game for the mission structure and the story and how there's 10 different endings but none of the endings are actually like any good or a satisfying conclusion and that there's a last story segment like the adventure games too where uh you know everything that you do the whole selling point of the game is completely nullified um because the last story segment is canon to the sonic franchise but what it does have if you get an a rank at the uh or for every mission so every mission or every stage has two or three missions and if you get an a rank on every mission you will unlock this ex expert mode which you go left to right top to bottom in the stage order and uh yeah you just kind of play through and get to the goal ring all uh, in one set of lives it's actually really easy to acquire lives in shadow the hedgehog um one of the best ways to do it is in the shadow crate which uh obviously we have 100 percent save file so we have all the guns available to us this vacuum gun, if you use all 30 of its ammunition, you get three extra lives. And because the rings decrease in tens on this game, uh, you only get a extra life if you pass a checkpoint with 100 rings. So kind of interesting stuff there. Um, but yeah, we're going to want as many extra lives as possible because this game gets pretty, uh, pretty unfair at points. But I'd like to say on my test playthrough that I did of expert mode that most of the issues were my fault and not necessarily the fault of the game though i won't say this game is good i just for some reason really enjoy it specifically in expert mode having over 100 rings is pog yeah especially since you lose 10 rings so every time you pass a checkpoint you essentially get a new uh new extra life it's very nice go a little bit faster down that thing there dude <laughs> yeah shadow is the stretchy arm guy <laughs> Oh, geez. Are we talking about Project 06? Can we not? <laughs> the whole point of me doing this is to take a break. I know it's hard to not talk about PO6. But you go from point A to point B, yeah, the way it should be. Yes, PO5, you're correct. The correct game to uh, talk about right now. <laughs> PO5 over PO6? Well, at least it's a complete game, am I right, guys? <laughs> anyway, so what's your guys' favorite stage from Shadow the Hedgehog? We're going to be seeing all of them, and we're going to be saw seeing all of them in what I think is their best form. Uh, some of them go a little long, most of the stages, just with how they're structured and how shadow works and i'm going to be taking things a bit slowly in the beginning to at least get some uh extra lives stocked up for the later uh half of the game but uh for the most part i mean the stages they're they're pretty good uh they're really flat well especially seeing in lethal highway which is coming up in two stages that we're just gonna hold forward and run but that's nothing new <laughs> in a sonic game anyway you never played it oh well it might be worth playing then at least in this form, this is by far the best way to play Shadow the Hedgehog. Not how the game is actually played, but this extra mode, because thankfully for us, the extra mode was kind of a tacked on feature and most of the stages are actually unchanged. Like they're not really any harder. They're just made to have a goal ring. Wait, 360 times? Hey, it's just 10. 
But yeah, no, you play Westopolis a lot of times. Do you just not have a lives counter? No, I do. The lives counter only shows up when you pause or when you lo lose a uh, life, just like in Sonic Heroes. Best stage is Cryptic Castle. It is Halloween season, so I guess appropriate that we're playing Shadow the Hedgehog for that. This is one of these cases of just weird movement that I like, is using the spin dash in this game. Because the spin dash functions a lot more like a classic game than it does the adventure games. You can't spam dash. You can only use it while Shadow is uh, still, but you can still jump out of it and do like uh, spin dash jumps and stuff. It's actually really cool. And I don't know if it depends on how fast you're going, but in my experience, as long as I let go of the control stick and wait like a second, I can initiate a spin dash. Airfleet? I hear a lot of good things people say about Airfleet. Airfleet's all right. The music's good. Yes, there are 326 ways to play this game. Kind of crazy. They're not all fun, but you can do it. <laughs> I think uh, I think a couple people have done it that I know. Like, I think that Sonic Gamer has done it and stuff. Yeah, we're over 100 rings again. Want to make sure to maintain that so we keep our lives up. Do 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 do. And I hope you guys are in for the long haul. This is going to be a long playthrough, so. Then you got good. There you go. Mainly Circus Park. Dude, Gun Fortress is dope. I can't wait till we get there just for the music. Postopolis run. Oh, yeah, that's right. I got a split. That's okay. It doesn't matter. I have it there more for the stage list than splits because this doesn't count anyway uh, in terms of like the leaderboards and such. Because you can't play on emulator. But we can do it for content, playing it the best way possible. I guess one thing I forgot to mention, I'm also playing with the 4K texture pack and widescreen mod. So hopefully it looks really good to you guys because it looks really good to me. Uh, excuse me? Oh, buddy, I'm supposed to shoot you. Six minutes, what's stop list? Dude, true. Hey, what's up, Boon Sonic? How you doing? I'm playing on legal. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Playing on legal hardware. Just, uh, it's a modded GameCube. Infinite ammo with the Gatling gun? Yes. Or just use the shadow rifle. This is how the game naturally looks. I mean, definitely the 4K and widescreen brings it up to like a 360 PS3 game for sure. Even then, for GameCube standards, Shadow the Hedgehog didn't look that good. So it's at like 2p? Interesting. I'm pretty sure mobile is 160p, but you know, whatever floats your boat, I guess. <laughs> well, I know Project 06 because I wanted to do this, and it's a Friday. This isn't even a normal stream day. Do, 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 because I do what I want. All right. Go ahead. Oh, we got that chaos blast. You know what that means? Infinite ammo, baby. So we can just... Blast this SMG, even though we have no enemies to hit. Do 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 do. Oh, that's funny. <laughs> do 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 do. Use that light that's blowing upward too. Get auto modded. Shadow killing. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. The, no, this game is a mess structurally. It's so bad. That's why when you remove all the fluff and just play through the stages from beginning to end in expert mode, it's actually super fun. Ah. Perfect. Do -do 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 -do. It's my favorite gun in this game. We'll get to it. I don't want to spoil it. Is level design good? No, the level design's not really that great. It's pretty boring, pretty bland. It's either super linear or super flat or both. But uh, that's not that's not really a case until we get to the stages that were designed to be non-linear stages. Oh my goodness. Tried to do that loop skip and almost paid the price for it, but we're good. What am I playing on? The computer. Tom streaming. Anything's a checkpoint there? There is. Also, for some reason, Shadow gets an ungodly amount of speed when he runs in this game. I don't know why, but they made him go super fast, which really helps during the flat sections. Yeah, another case of the spin dash. I don't know, man. I don't know why I enjoy playing this game. It's not a good game. I don't want anyone to think that it is a good game, because it isn't, but I enjoy it for some reason. 
do 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 at most of the dark age for sure for sure yeah this is uh this is right down there with 06 in terms of killing the franchise but you know at least there's something to salvage from it and the expert mode's pretty fun just that no one ever played it because my goodness the ungodly requirement to a rank every single mission in this game it sounds terrible to do legitimately i just you know use somebody else's save file <laughs> That's how it be. That's how we do around here. Cut out the fluff. All right, fine. Guess we can't destroy that particular debris. Using the vacuum gun's a little bit rough here because I'm going to get bopped by these things as they fly past us. Because normally you can shoot them with a gun, but I want to get those three extra lives. They're going to be very important later. Lost impact? Yeah, lost impact is probably the worst stage in the game. Guys, I think the jokes run pretty thin now, hasn't it? <laughs> the suck gun. Yes, it's the good suck. I believe this is the gun you get for completing the like the neutral pathway, which is like the pathway everyone completes first. And it's so overpowered. Like, <laughs> I don't know why they give it to you first, because obviously that's what everyone's going to complete first. Do, do, do. How many more days until November 8th? It's probably like, I don't know, 23. Nah, not 23, like 20, 29. 27. 27. 27's my final answer. Just suck up those uh, gun soldiers. And yeah, this game's rated E10. You little chaos control. Not much going on in Glyphic Canyon anyway. <laughs> oh, this is a good chaos control. Can't be bothered to do the missions. That's why you just download a save file. And you're good. Give me those three extra lives. All right, we're sitting with 15. That's pretty good, I'd say. Run. So we got 16 lives coming out of Glyphic Canyon. The gun is bigger than Shadow. That's going to be a, uh, Perfect. a theme you'll see. 18? Nice. That's really close. <laughs> That's a little over two weeks for Frontiers. Well, how you doing, buddy? Just a chow egg? It might as well be. Can't you put memory cards into computers? I'm sure you can. Well, lethal highway time. Here we go. Give me this and that. Let's see if we can do this. There's a little bit of a speed running trick here. Getting the fire shield. Looks like we just missed it, but... That's fine. The nice thing about the fire shield in this game is any one hit enemy you just barrel through. So all these little like goop monsters, you would literally just barrel through them with the fire shield is really nice. But you know, can't win them all. Still more than playable of a stage. You just won't be able to use chaos control as much. Get a little bit more ammo here. Come on. Dude. Do, do, do. All right, one of the weirdest elements, riding the black goop. I don't really quite understand the reason behind this. is essentially a grind rail without actually being a grind rail. See you later, pal. Destroy some of the, uh, the aliens here to fill up our good meter. Even though there is no morality in expert mode, there's still morality in gameplay, so yay. Do, do. The stage's music is really good. Chad the Hedgehog isn't like the best soundtrack overall, but it's certainly got some bangers in it. Uh, let's go ahead. I'm going to grab the vacuum gun again to see if we can get some more extra lives. There are a lot of these little like goopy enemies, so it should be pretty easy to, to get lives like that. Unfortunately, the vacuum guns can't suck up everything. And once we get to like the stage three stages, it's going to be pretty much useless. We won't be able to suck up anything with it. But mostly everything in the early stages will be able to... Uh, collects just fine. The suck gun. <laughs> oh my goodness. You missed these streams? Yeah, dude, I missed them too. We tried doing this yesterday, but uh, Charter Internet said no. <laughs> Alright, here we go. Chaos Control. Lost Impact's got some good stuff. But this is what I was talking about with the level design being like super flat. Like, here we are. I'm literally just running forward. 
Again, this is because of the hero mission in this stage where you have to shoot down the tank. They wanted to give you a long stretch to be able to do a lot of damage to it. But in expert mode's case, it's just this really weird long stretch of land where nothing happens. Give me more goop monsters. Give me the goop. All right, I got 20 lives. It's a very nice amount to have. I am cringe, but I am all of me. <laughs> happens. Do oh, Shadow's now old enough to drink. 21, let's go. How many lives do you guys think I'm going to have by the end of this? We got a long way to go. I believe there's 26 stages in this game, so we got we got a lot to do. Do speedruns of Unleashed? No, probably not. I don't I don't really speedrun any game other than Project 06, and I'll probably never speedrun any game other than Project 06. Unless Frontiers really wows me, I will probably never speedrun a game other than uh, Project 06. I'm just playing through. The timer is there to make it look good, you know? That's how it would be. Um, am I missing something? Who's not dead? Ah, uh, you're not dead. Now you are. Whoop, there we go. Thank you. Gunplay makes some of these challenges really easy, but I assume that's the point. Also, fun thing about grinding in this game, there's no speed cap, so you can go insanely fast on rails. Some of the Shadow Runner. Yeah, that's the thing, though, is you have to play on original hardware in order to uh, speedrun this game for the leaderboards. Fun to play through, like, casually fast, though, which is what I'm doing right now. Trying to do, anyway. Has anyone seen where it is? Three? You think three lives? All right. The rails really go zoom in this game. Oh yeah, I forgot to split too. We're doing so good. <laughs> Get 40 lives in Circus Park, that's true. For Cir Circus Park, I really, really want to get Chaos Control in a certain part. Before Beats released it, it's really, really good. We're uh, about 10 days, so about 10 hours. I'd say probably 11 hours into making my custom stage, and it's turning out pretty good so far. You can see updates for it on Twitter. I think what I might do instead of daily updates on it though, I might just do weekly updates because not enough changes in a day at this point because we're doing a lot more detail work. Wait, what's that prediction? Is it to get a game over? Because if I game over, then it's over. <laughs> I guess I would save state if I had a uh, had like one life left though. Give me this, please. Uh. I don't really like the challenges that requires you to use a particular weapon when the weapon sucks like this. <laughs> but uh, oh well, that's how the level is designed. Thankfully, that pretty much only happens here. So light the torches. Erta Castle is great. Happy Halloween! <laughs> Got yeeted off that platform. Do, do, do. Do. It's been going, been a while since last year's stream. Ah, oh, it's pretty good. Pretty good. Obviously, uh, we've had a lot of growth and it's been really cool. A lot of new faces around here pretty much every single day. Which is super fun, but uh, yeah, everything's going well. YouTube's going well. Um, yeah, I think I figured out what I'm going to do content-wise. You know, obviously we're going to have this on the YouTube. I'll probably split this up into some parts and uh, release them next week to get a backlog. And then that gives me a lot more options when it comes to what I want to create. You're a doubter? What is it? What, what's the prediction? I can't see it. I can only see, like, will Stomo get a... Get a... A game over is inevitable? I hope to not get a game over, because if we get a game over, that's it. Like, uh, you end... You end, uh, expert mode. You have to start from the beginning. So I really hope we don't get one. In my test playthrough, I didn't game over. 
I got really close, but I didn't game over. Do some shadow pathways to mess around? Wait, what do you mean? Whoops, that was not the right way to go. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. Her point's not gonna know through? I don't know. Maybe Twitch being goofy, something like that. You're gonna play Project Frontiers? What's- I don't even know what Project Frontiers is. It went through three times, let's go. Yo- oh, damn it. What's the prediction? Can someone tell me? Do I have to look? Oh, will I get a game over? Okay. There's no way. I, I legitimately can't get a game over or else we'd have to start from the beginning and that would be... That would be horrible. <laughs> Waiting patiently for the 06 stream? Yeah, we'll see if it happens. No guarantees. Damn it. Invested 15k? Oh, I can't guarantee anything. I mean, that's you who invested the points, not me, so not my problem. <laughs> uh. Should be good. We are good. The light dash can be a bit finicky sometimes, but thankfully that worked out well. It's those really, like, tricky platforming sections that really uh, get my nerves going in this game. All right, we're gonna do a spin dash, come up here to the secret doorway. Uh, Cause this skips a huge chunk of the level that's not very interesting, nor is it very fun. All right, we need the, uh, need this guy, not that guy, but we need this. Don't get attached, ah, GN, with the old wisdom. Wise words from a wise man, never get attached. Die in a certain stage? That'd be a weird prediction. I mean, it doesn't matter now, the prediction's over, so. That Minecraft stream again? I don't know what this has to do with Minecraft at all, but all right. Will be ultra good, yeah. Do, do. Hey, you see, taking that secret door, we're literally already at the end. And there's this super scary, like, Halloween monster, but uh, you go too fast on the rails to see it. It looks like a pretty cool monster, though. Against you and you lost? Hey, that's just how it is, man. That's It's called gambling. <laughs> Have you heard of it before? It's not like the outcome's ever guaranteed unless you rig it. I don't wanna. All right, all right. Uh, yeah, let's do that. Beautiful. Quarter of the way through, maybe. We'll see how long this takes. Do 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 do. Here's one of these stages. I have a lot of memories with this one. I'm not entirely sure why. I never played a lot of Shadow as a kid, but. Alright, give me that. This is where the vacuum gun starts becoming less useful. It'll work on these gun bots and stuff, but not like these bigger guys. Uh, give me that. Want, always want more ammunition. Don't send me to jail? I don't plan on sending anybody to jail. <laughs> At least I don't think so. Do. This level looks cool. Yeah, it looks fantastic with the 4K textures, especially like the goop. It's very nice. Also, hopefully I'll be able to uh, get Chaos Blast leveled up and we'll see some cool uh, speed running in this level, but uh, we'll see. Whoops, why, why was I continuing to go forward? That was strange. Do 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 And do a little spin dash here. Kill an extra enemy just for a little bit more ammunition. And I don't think we need any more of this. 
This is why I get all those lives early in the run, so that way I can kind of just play this stage and not have to worry about getting hurt and stuff. Even though, like I've said before, you lose 10 rings and that's it. Uh, whenever you get hit in this game. So that's really nice. 10 or less, I guess, technically. Die. Do, do, do. Platforming over bottomless pits? Doing the dimps thing, I see. Um, okay, we're one step away from the chaos control, so... I kind of want to be a bit specific with uh, where I hit it. And it's not right here, but I believe... Uh, can I get on top of this? I don't think so. I think I have to do like a spin dash jump here or something. Ah, oh, man. Darn it. You're supposed to be able to do a spin dash jump and then... Uh, you're not allowed to use Chaos Control in this particular section. They want you to destroy these enemies, but if you get up high enough, you're able to actually skip it and just do the Chaos Control anyway. But not for us, alas. Do, 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 do. Only doubters in chat? Yeah, that's how it be. People don't have faith in me anymore. <laughs> I'm too known. Everyone got too comfortable. Ow. Hey, what's up, Jintoki? How you go? How you going? See ammunition? Yes, it's uh, it's very interesting for it to be in a uh, to be in this game. But you know, that's uh, that's how it is. All right, I think there's something that could uh, get us chaos blast somewhere around here. Only only hero meter stuff. Normally, I'm supposed to be able to have chaos blast and run along here. But, uh, doesn't look like that's the case. Oh, it looks like that did something. Wasn't there something I could flip down here, too? There was. Yeah! <laughs> Fuck yeah! Uh, nothing to give me some dark meter? Oh, that sucks. Nothing to give me hero meter, either. Pretty close to both, actually. Uh, these guys can probably... Yeah, there it is. We'll just chaos control it. Why not? Do 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 Nero man, wow. This really takes you all the way through, goddamn. Then we can just chaos blast the rest of the way. He goes, when you're full up on the meter, you have infinite ammunition and you're completely invincible. Now obviously we want to use chaos control, but chaos blast sucks, so we don't want to use that one. And hopefully you have a good gun in your hand for the infinite ammunition or else uh, it's going to be a rough time because you can't get rid of your weapon while you uh, have chaos blasts or anything active. Where's my saucer? What's with the meta guns? What do you mean? You mean like from the shadow crate? Like uh, the Billy Hatcher and the giant egg and stuff? Yeah, that's just in the game. Destroy property, yes. Shadow the uh, the property destroyer? It's like Link destroying all those pots. Shadow's gun tier list when? I mean, it's literally the shadow rifle and the Gatling gunner at the top. There you go. S tier. Best guns in the game. Shadow rifle is without a doubt the best gun in the game. Pop off that and fall our way to the goal ring. Beautiful. Less than 30 minutes in. Perfect. I believe that speedruns of this category can go under an hour, which is kind of crazy just with how optimized you can get with your meter management and stuff. You get the invincibility and chaos control where you need it. Do, 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 do. All right, sounds good, Amazon. Enjoy your stream, pal. Alright, so here I want to be very specific with where I get Chaos Control, because it skips a, a life-eating section. Literally, the only reason the section is there is to just chew your lives away. Let's see if I can get this uh, little trick here. You do a spin dash jump off this little piece of terrain. It's not really that hard to do. But uh, I'm just not jumping fast enough. Woo! Ah, there we go. Speed run! Let's go! 
Yeah, Circus Park. This is another stage that I have a lot of uh, memories with. That damn fourth Chaos Emerald, true. For this game, it's like a Batman trailer. Yes, I have seen it. It's quite funny. <laughs> the uh, vacuum gun's actually very good for this stage. We need to start sucking up these guys and getting these hero points as quickly as possible. As the section's coming soon, it's not. Uh, it's not quite, quite there, but uh, it's coming up shortly. Alrighty. <laughs> Thank you, Barrel. Very cool. Do a little spin dash jump arena there. Ow. All right, we have enough stocked up to where we can, uh... We can just kind of ignore enemies until we get to that particular section. And then we can use chaos control. Do, 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 do. Suck up those rings. I like how you can suck up rings with the vacuum gun too. It's a nice little detail. Um, I'll get one more just for safety. That'll definitely guarantee us the... When do we get uninhibited mode? Dude, I don't know. Is uninhibited mode in this game? <laughs> the chaos abilities are kind of like that. Like, not the... Well, I guess chaos boost is basically chaos blast, right? Trying not to get blown up by a bazooka there. Whee! Alright, we should be good to go. So there's this barrel section that's even worse than the barrel section from Sonic 3 and Knuckles, but we just get chaos control and we chaos control, we can skip right over that and thank the Lord we can because, oh my goodness, that section is horrible. Probably the worst section in all of expert mode, honestly. Circus Park was actually changed quite a bit. <laughs> Need to S rank all the stages? Yeah, and the ranks only go, go up to uh, A in this game, so. Kind of screwed there, unfortunately. There's so many rings. Ow! Woo! Alright, time to suck up everything we can. See if we can get some more lives. Gotta get a nice stockpile while we still can in these easier stages. Alright, we're good. And this should be the end of Circus Park, I believe. Pretty short stage. Yeah, it's a pretty cool idea, an incentive to to destroy enemies in this game. And it's really cool. Also, funny thing, the vacuum gun's supposed to stay straight up, so it kind of just wobbles. <laughs> it's kind of funny. Do do. I'm just gonna clip through here. No big deal. The Sonic game. Whoa! Almost just fell right off that platform. Beautiful stuff. Sonic games didn't get the S rank until 06. Adventure 2, Heroes, and Shadow all have A rank as the highest. 